Okay, hello YouTube. Uh, today I got something off, uh, off the internet uh, from a company called 12 South, and it's something called the Book Arc, uh, which uh, is usable for the MacBook, and it is something like this. Your MacBook actually sits in like this, so I'll, I'll demonstrate in a while. And um, yeah, it features nice, um, nice rubber feet, and you just place it uh, on your table. Um, these rubber things are exchangeable. This one is numbered number one, and I've got some others that are less wide and a bit wider for use for other different books. This one, the one is for use for the 13-inch MacBook, the 13, 15, 17-inch MacBook Pro. Uh, so that's the aluminum unibody. Uh, and then the number two is used uh, usable for the 13-inch MacBook White and many previous MacBook models. And number three is used for the MacBook Air. So, um, yeah. Uh, I mean, it, it, it gives you a nice manual how to install and, and remove those things, but I thought it would be nice to just to just uh, uh, get out the MacBook and show you the setup. Okay, well, it's been juicing up for a while. So this is my aluminum unibody MacBook, and you just put it put it in like so. So it sits there with the uh, with all the connectors down. So you have just a couple of things coming off, and uh, yeah, it just sits there. Uh, it's not really a, uh, a docking station, but something close. In a spot where I think I would be wanting to use it, and I'll just put in the and I'll put in the power. Like that. Oh. <laughs> okay, so you get an, so you get an impression of how it's looking. But yeah, I mean, it's you can just slide it in there, and it just sits there. You can turn. Uh, the, the good thing is that you can turn on the Mac. I might actually show that keyboard for it. This is actually going to be the setup that I'm going to be using in my new study. Like, like so. And I'm going to be plugging it into the... Uh, so, I mean, it does have a bit of a bit of room that you can experiment with others. If I put it up straight, uh, it tends to open up a bit, so I just put it on. So, and this this setup is actually a lot faster, quite a bit faster than my uh, than my uh, uh, than my desktop, my Windows desktop. So, yeah, I mean, great stuff. And uh, I'll I'll cut this short, make another video, and I'll show you uh, it how it works. Yeah, well. The only not so great part is that you, you do have to boot up your MacBook uh, so that it works. So then I close the Mac and just put it in the stand. Oh. So, yeah, I mean, I'm not using my MacBook on a daily basis, so uh, it's okay if, if I have it sitting in this, in this con contraption. Okay, so uh, now it is running, and I'll I'll use my mobile phone to actually uh, uplo upload uh, pictures of it running. So we'll have that later in this video. Okay, so the video is recording. Well, this is my Windows desktop, and I've been using this. And now I switch around the monitor to analog, and there. We have my 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 desktop of my MacBook, which is quite a good system. It's uh, running at 2.4 gig.
gigahertz it's a core to duo four gigabytes of memory is what is it 1067 megahertz ddr3 and the good thing is that and it also comes with a geforce m um, graphics card so running games on this is fairly easy okay something else to show you parallels desktop uh, which i use to boot windows 7 this this actually gives you an impression on how this is running on parallels and you must understand that this system this this macbook uh it it uh it oh look and you have here like three three uh, wires coming out you can just tuck those away and you have a nice very nice sleek desktop you know i can i can shove it back down a bit further i've actually gotten a, a second power supply to be used with it and I, I need to find out if this is the best uh, rubber slot for it or if I need to use one of these uh, the others um, if I put it up straight look the book tends to open up a bit and I don't like that so I'm just gonna put it like this the cooling still works because underneath here uh, the cooling vents uh, still uh, have room to uh, get the air out and Windows 7 has booted up, so I'm going to key in the password. All right, so it can continue to boot. So this is my Windows desktop, my virtual Windows desktop. And I thought it would be nice to show you what does work. Yeah, this is a Steam game. So... I'm gonna let it c connect. So yeah, I mean it's it's looking sleek, it's looking nice. I mean, and if this is the only thing standing on your desk and you have the wires tucked away and you have this keyboard, I could also have opted for the Bluetooth keyboard, but I'm I'm not. Um, uh, I have a Bluetooth mouth mouse. Uh, but yeah, I mean this is a very nice minimalistic thing and. Um, this this keyboard actually types like a ver t types exactly like the uh, like the um, what is it like the, uh, the 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 notebook keyboard and it's big and wide it's it's full size it's really nice I mean I really love this I, I didn't think I would love it but and it has like the, like the older keyboards it has like two USB ports oh yeah look Geometry Wars play game now the uh, yeah, you can use around. Uh, yeah, you can use it. You can move around with uh, these keys, and you can shoot with the uh, with the mouse. But as you can see, it does it does allow you to play ver uh, games, and and, the, and and it's actually better than it and than what it looks like right now because of the the phone I use to to tape this. But yeah. Uh, Excellent stuff. Um, let me see. Old. Oops. <laughs> Look when I'm running it. Um, whoops. Uh, resume game. So I return to main menu. Whoops. Uh, uh, yeah. Quit. Uh, yeah. So if you have a Mac. Uh, running parallels is great and you can also uh, run this in some sort of seamless mode uh, but yeah it's really nice well this is uh, some non-gaming related uh, stuff that I uh, was showing uh, yeah I'm gonna pack this away but this is going to be my new uh, desk setup you know I'm gonna have this <laughs> in some other room gonna have the gaming PC rig I'll, I'll connect to uh, a monitor in my gaming room this 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 system will probably be used as some sort of multimedia PC and um, yeah okay well um, let's quit parallels desktop um, 
shut down the Mac. Right, well, I'm, uh, I'm going to quit now.